Well, here we are. I don't know what to do. I will defend this position. I'm sure none come to the castle's defense. And at luck with them.
<sighs> I think I've been raised to it. <sighs> yes. You speak to the people. We'll tell them the truth about luck in the air. The crown deserves to be worn by a noble man. I'll see you in Christ. You've stopped the lost conquest of this kingdom. I have to wonder. Word of uh, we were in the tavern after work. I would under Yes, you hear I know of no cure, but there's an old man.
I often I do not see a hole in your head. Perhaps a hole in your head. The stones to the north. I truly think the wisdom in some old stones will save you. In memory of Thor Warden Ramanos Avila, bearer of the Eternal Torch, whose strategy centuries all souls made in time, but he held steadfast against the darkness until the last. May his sacrifice be a lesson to all who come after.
in memory of Soul Warden Christina Krenkel, whose gaze never wavered. Her pursuit of humanity's best nature, her defiance of darkness, and her commitment of our hopes burning until the last. May her sacrifice be a lesson to all who come after. Thing doing a bear cave. of Soul Warden Ray's Vita. Devoted servant of the Order, he took no pride, no ambition in our sacred duty. All that was asked and much that was done. Ah. Willing. By his example, other than me are his purpose. May his sacrifice be a lesson to all who come after. Thank <laughs> you. 
memory of Soul Warden Constanza Soberia, who gave all that was to be given. May her sacrifice be a lesson for those who come after. But then, if the voice you hear is not heard by me.
solemnly bow under the radiance of the sun and the luminescence of the stars in the presence of the gods to serve as an Amara, the blessed inheritor of the eternal fire.
vow to be both noble and true, to heed the divine voice, and to aid my people against all hardships and foes. I also seek on my bonded soul to ease the world's pain and to prepare my soul up to you, regardless of the No conviction will keep it. I give my breath to the winds, my strength to the lands, and my spirit to the firmament. That it rain down into the blessed earth and the depths of the water to seal my oath for all time and for all those who would follow in my path. And the kinds of people you run into. Ha! Ah, thought I heard scuffling in those ruins. I was thinking there might be now that you mention.
Welcome to the autumn rest. Always a colorful place to be. You hit if I'm excellent. I have a guitar. But then... Try, did he? I'll have to give him a comment. Can't say that name sparks any torches. Perhaps he was just passing through. If that's the case, I must guard Captain Moore. Wiggle <laughs> now. That is a most great place. Come to grease my palms about the ah! hold them well boys a covenant marauders and syndicate as a heavy have you come it is quite heavy i would hate for you to hurt yourself but i suppose the moon and planets are aligned in a way that suggests Slide on over, friend. You look like one of the marauder types. <laughs> like adventure? Maybe a bit of a scrub, Oi, you're not right. You've done us a well. Let it fancy the fashion. The finer the better. The hides of Midnight Wolves are highly prized. If you could acquire some from their den, I could turn them into fine coats.
Ah, uh, there it is. Ah, uh, very astute. I would like you to play the part of a traveling bard. Find individuals of influence throughout the town and play my melody before them. Ensure that you mention my pen name, Composer Marseus. If you want to embellish a little, perhaps you could also mention how prolific my work is. Ah, I see you have my fruit. Do you mean to awe me with a song? I will always make time for pleasant music. <laughs> oh, it gives me great joy. Do proceed. Oh! I will remember that name. Uh, do convey my appreciation. Be prolific indeed if their work can stand out so in a city like ours. Was that the lilting of a flute I heard? Yes, I do have a sharp ear. If your work is of such quality, I know several individuals who will be delighted to learn your name. Oh, 
is that the name? I'll be sure to ask other bards if they know any of Marcias's songs. How did it go? What a relief. This is ter- Fine. One never approaches a noble personage without an introduction. There are only a handful of people who can arrange one. We need to find out who they are. Start with their maid, Sarah. She always has her ear to the ground. <laughs> 